Hi guys, it's Emily with Cozy Clicks, and today I'm going to show you how to use the adjustment brush in Lightroom. Now, the adjustment brush is a great tool to use when you want to target one specific area of your photo without affecting the rest of the image. Let me show you how to do that right now. Now, in this particular image, I'm noticing that the exposure is a little underexposed. And I showed you exactly how to do this in one of the previous videos, but really quickly, to increase the exposure, all I'm going to do is drag this slider to the right, and you can see that the exposure is brightening. Now, I like the way it's looking in their faces, but the background of this image is too bright. And you'll notice that that happens a lot, especially if you have a bright sky in the background, that the exposure is just a little bit too much when you increase that slider. So I'm going to bring that back down so I get the background the way that I like it. And that looks good right there. But I still want to target their faces. I want to target this particular part of the image without affecting the background. So what I'm going to do is grab that adjustment brush, which is over in the top toolbar on the right hand side. It says adjustment brush and it's a picture of a brush. So we're going to click that and it's going to give me a new menu right here with the same sliders. And I'm going to adjust those sliders back to zero right now. You see they're changed around. And I know that I want to increase the exposure of their faces. So I'm going to increase this exposure right now, but I can change that later if I need to. With that adjustment brush, I'm just going to brush on the areas of, of the photo that I want to change or adjust. So it's going to affect just that area. Okay. Now, by doing that, I increase the exposure on their faces, but still left the rest of the image untouched. It's pretty cool. And if we wanted to do that with other sliders, we could do that as well. So we're not just affecting just the exposure, but let's say we wanted the white balance a little warmer or cooler. You can look and see how that's changing on just their faces. We're going to keep that where it was though. If you wanted to increase or decrease the highlights on just their face, you could do that as well. I could bring it up or down and you can see the changes that are happening there you could increase or decrease any of the sliders here in just the targeted areas that you want. And that's what makes the adjustment brush so cool. I hope you learned a little something. Uh, I'd love if you'd subscribe to my channel. You'll see the whole free Lightroom training series up on the playlist on my channel now. Thanks for watching.